Hey everybody, welcome back to State of Tech. This is James here. Another iPhone 5S quick tip for you. I'm going to show you how to use iTunes Radio on the iPhone 5S. So if we open up our music application, it's going to launch us here into our iTunes Radio tab down here in the bottom. You see up the top I have some featured stations that iTunes has featured based upon maybe some listening preferences, tr trending on Twitter. We have some guest DJs. You see if I scroll through, I might find some DJs like Jared Leto from 30 Seconds to Mars. He's a guest DJ on one station, and he's curating music based upon what he likes. We have another one, guest DJ Katy Perry. And if I were to tap on any one of those featured stations, it's going to go and start playing that station for me. Now, down below that, I have stations that I've created. You see I have my stations, Tudor Cinema Club, Capital Cities, 30 Seconds to Mars, Lincoln Park, and even Daft Punk. And then I have this separate Waze radio, which is based upon a song. And then I have a couple of genre stations down here at the bottom. If I tap edit right here above my stations, it's going to allow me to add a new station, even tap on any one of the stations I have existing and rename it, share the station, add some artists to play more like, and never to play artist songs or genres in the station as well. And then at the bottom, I can even delete the station if I wanted to. Now I'll go ahead and hit done out of this edit menu. And we'll come in here, and if I want to play a station, let's just go ahead and start playing one. I'll tap on that, and it's going to start playing the radio station that I've selected. You see I have my playback controls. I can play and pause, skip this song. I have a star, so if I tap on the star, I can choose to play more like this, never play this song, or even add this to my iTunes wish list. Up in the top menu, I have the 129, which lets me buy the song off iTunes Store. And then the information button, if I tap on that, I can do the iTunes store again. I can create a new station from this artist, new station from this song. I can tune the station to play only hits, more of a variety or discovery. I can allow explicit tracks and then I can share the station down here in the bottom menu. So now I'm gonna come back out and let's go ahead and create a new station now that we've been playing one. So I'm gonna come down here, tap on new station and I'm presented with a bunch of different genres that I can choose from. So if I were looking for one, let's just say hits of the 80s, I'll tap on that, and this is a genre that I can choose from. So I have 80s classic, college rock, freestyle, hair metal, hip hop, new wave. So if I were to tap on one of these, let's tap on 80s rock. I'm gonna get a preview, you see the playback controls right here. I got a preview of that station, and if I wanted to add it, I'll tap on it again, hit this plus button. Now it's added it to my stations, and it's going to go ahead and start playing that station for me. But that was just based upon iTunes genres that it suggested here in the menu. And if I add a new station again, I can tap up here in the top field an artist, genre, or song. So let's go ahead and type in here. We're going to go ahead and tap on that. Let's just type in Journey. They're one of my favorite bands. Now I type in Journey. Then we'll tap search. And now you see I have some top hits. Top hit is Journey Radio based upon the artist. Then I have some artists that it's suggesting down here in the bottom based upon typing in Journey. And then I have songs. So these are the three basic fields. You're going to have artists, songs, or genres. So now if I found the artist I'm looking for, just tap on Journey Radio. And it's going to go ahead and load that radio, add it to my stations, and then begin playing it. And that's how you use iTunes Radio on the iPhone 5S.